Hi, I'm Bill from CJ Pony Parts. Today we're going to show you how to install a Steeda oil separator on your Focus ST. You might be wondering what the oil separator does. Well, it's going to install into your PCV system. The PCV is an emission system designed to take gases from your crankcase and recirculate them back through your engine. In most cases, this is actually a good emissions device and doesn't cause any problems. The harder you drive your car though and the more boost you make, the more chance of oil coming back through the PCV, which going through your intake can actually damage your engine. The oil separator will allow the gases to pass through, but it's going to catch the oil, which can protect your motor. Steed includes everything necessary to install their oil separator onto your Focus ST. It comes with the rubber hoses, all your fittings, hose clamps, as well as the cylinder. The cylinder has a filter inside and also has a relief valve at the bottom, making it easier to drain. For this installation, you'll need a 3 8 ratchet, extension, 15 millimeter socket, 10 millimeter socket, T30 Torx bit, quarter inch ratchet, eight millimeter socket, 14 millimeter wrench, and hose cutters. The oil separator is gonna install on the PCV hose, which is located right here behind our intake. If you're still running a stock intake, it's a two piece design. You can separate the tube here and take it out and be able to reach it. In case of our solid intake, it's a little harder to get to. We don't really want to remove our intake, so we're going to pop off the cowl. That way we can get to it from behind. To remove the cowl, we're going to start by removing our wipers, and there's one bolt underneath these covers here, another bolt on the end, and the whole cowl will come off. Pull the rubber cap off first. We want to flip the wiper up, kind of shimmy it a little bit to get it off. Next, we'll remove the outer screws on both sides. Now remove these plastic covers on both sides. See the last two bolts underneath. There's only a couple clips that hold it in now so we can carefully remove it. We're going to remove the factory hose. Once you remove the factory hose, you want to cut it right here before the curve. And discard the smaller piece. Now we'll assemble the oil separator. There's a right angle fitting for one side and a straight fitting for the other. They are plastic, so you don't get them too tight. Just make sure they're snug. The short hose will go on the right angle side over here. And the longer one goes on the straight fitting. I'm going to put a hose clamp on this side over here and put the straight fitting in. And we're ready to test fit it on our car. We'll start by reinstalling our cut factory tube on our intake. You want to put the last hose clamp loosely on this hose before you install it on the car. You connect the side with the 90 degree. I'm going to put the whole hose down below this. Connect to your valve cover. Now that it's in place, we can tighten that up. Now this hose will loop around here, connect right on top to our factory hose. That completes the installation for the oil separator itself. Now we can reinstall our cowl. and your installation's finished. 
As you can see, the Steedle oil separator is a fairly simple installation that can save you costly engine repair bills in the future. Installation should only take you around half an hour, so you'll be back on the road in no time.